So it is the night before I film my typical day with me tomorrow, but I wanted to show you guys what I did today, which was organize and declutter a lot of my room. Over here, I decluttered a bunch of stuff and got rid of a lot of things in this area. And then this area I still haven't, I decluttered this, but that's pretty much it. And then, yeah, that's, that's what goes on. Organize my yarn and then whatever was in that basket. That's what I wanted to show you guys. Good morning, everyone. Typically, I don't wake up this late, but I'm on spring break. So then I take you guys with me. Typical day in my life, but not really because usually I have class. It's water in the morning. I'm gonna put a sweater on. Here's the lucky sweater of the day. I don't know what I'm gonna do, to be honest. Yeah. It's been raining a lot. I don't really wanna go outside because of it. But what I can tell you is I have a little bit of homework to catch up on. This is my woodcut piece, and I need to work on it today. I need to work on this today. I have not been working on this, and I'm actually supposed to be on my fourth one, and this is my third one. Actually, I'm supposed to be my fifth one, and this is my third one. So, what I'm doing instead the past few days of winter, uh, spring break, I started a new hat. Um, this is the one from the other video. This one, and I ran out of red, so I started gray, and then I ran out of the gray, so now I don't know what to do. And I didn't have any more thick yarn, so I'm gonna have to go. Maybe I'll go get yarn today or something. But and if I do find this red, I'm literally just gonna like take all this out and just do that red. No solid plans today, but I'm gonna take you guys along with me for whatever happens. I don't have a big morning routine, as you guys will know. I don't wear like makeup every day. And I definitely don't want to wear any today because it's raining, it's cold. I'm gonna go get some coffee. staying at my parents for a bit and me and my dad went to the store and we found this and I wanted to try it because I've tried the normal one. I have never tried this like light one. Also it's like way cheaper than on campus. If I drink this on an empty stomach, it gets really upset because I'm also a little bit lactose, so. I'm going to put this egg on my bagel. I like to put an egg on my bagel just for protein or like another substance other than carbs. So I do have some homework I need to do today. Well, I have to finish all this. It's due on the 28th and today is the 23rd. Plans for later on in break and I don't want to be stuck doing this for like a while so I'm going to just get it done today or most of it done today boring but it's for my art in installation class I was thinking about titling this an art vlog I'm titling this art vlog but I don't want to title it an art vlog because it's just like a typical day in my life type of thing that I wanted to show you it's the thing with being an art major too I feel like sometimes art can be like tedious because of the projects we have to do. I really enjoy our projects, but sometimes I, I think my brain starts to warp it into like, I have work to do. So but yeah, I probably will sketch today. I've been doing a lot of studying, as in I've been doing like a lot of body studies and stuff to just like brush up on the technique. I'm getting scared that I'm losing. What is, what's the, if you don't use it, you lose it. So maybe I'll do that. Bagel sandwich literally just an egg <laughs> also if you're wondering where i'm doing homework i'm in my kitchen at my childhood home a pc down here my dad has like a million pcs and monitors a lot of them throughout the house and i'm 
doing it in the kitchen because I wanted to get out of my room for a second while I eat bre breakfast. But I will be back up in my room after I get a few questions done. I wanted to show you guys what I'm looking at. This is one of our slides. And I have to pick two artists out of all of these artists and say why their intervention site-specific installation is effective. And that might sound like gibberish to you if you are not familiar with a deeper context installation art, but basically it's just a style of installation art. Um, and yeah, <laughs> it, it's, it's mostly interactive and it focuses less on the aesthetic of the space and more on, um, it focuses more on physical dim dimension rather than aesthetic function and also its interaction with the viewer, which is very interesting. So I have to pick two from this whole thing. Ooh, that looks cool. I might, I might do this one. So my homework, I'll show you what I did, I guess. It's not that exciting though. These two paragraphs and these questions. Um, so for every new project we have, we have a research section for like one week and that includes a research paper and we have to answer a bunch of questions and look through this book and stuff. So it's not just art, which um, may be surprising to some people. Some classes are just art, but a lot of college art classes will have a segment right before you start like a new topic or a new project. Um, just to educate you on what it's supposed to be, I guess. Crochet, I've done a few rows so far. And I'm thinking of selling this one because I already have a green and gray one, but it, de it depends how it turns out. If it doesn't turn out well, then I'm not gonna sell it. But I'm thinking of making a couple for like a drop, maybe like four or five hats. And I kind of want to do like a cute design on this, like a star thing or something. I've been crocheting a little, not too much progress, but I left one of my cro my metal crochet hooks at home. So now I have to use this plastic one, which is also fine. It's been raining a lot recently and you've probably noticed because all of my vlogs, it's rainy as hell. It's spring, so, or it's beginning to be spring. So that's what that's probably about. A typical day, I usually have class, but as we all know, I don't have class right now because we're on break. But I wanted to film another one of these when I have class. I think that'll be fun for you guys to watch, especially if you're interested in my major and things like that. These days I have been a little overstimulated where I don't want to be online too much. So I don't have Instagram on any, well, I don't have Instagram on my phone, but I have it on my iPad. But that's like way better than having it on my phone because I have my phone with me all the time and my iPad is not with me all the time, so. Yeah, if you guys ever have those moments where you're so like agitated or um, overstimulated that you just like stare at a wall, like you can't even watch a video or like listen to music, you're just like, I need the silent. This is how far I got. Not too far, I kept taking breaks. But amongst but. other books I have. I decided to read a little bit. This is one of those books where I feel like I can't like sit down and read completely because it's so much information and like advice. So I kind of just skip around and read whatever. So I'm just gonna read a little bit of this for maybe like 15 minutes. There's a chapter that I'm interested in. We'll get some yarn. I don't need to, but I want to. I get more of this yarn, like this fuzzy 
yarn because I love this hat. I want to make more hats like this. A good idea for these. I want to make it like these, like kind of like slouchy and slinky, and then maybe add like a star accent or just something cute. It's coming out, kind of. I've made it to the Joann's. Wow, look at those clouds. I think I'm gonna grab some shirts as well. I have a sale on them and I wanted to try that design on the shirts. So I'm gonna get a black one, I think, and maybe some colored ones. So we'll do a little haul. I will show you what I got. So I'll show you what I got. This was on clearance and it's like a finger knitting and it's a monstera leaf. And I just thought this would be really cute for Mother's Day or my mom's birthday with like a cute card or something. So I got that. I was looking for the yarn like this and this was the closest thing I could find. Obviously it's not the same, but I really did like how soft this was and I kind of like like the texture. But I got, I got these three and then I got this one too, which... I really like the colors of. I think this would be a super cute hat. I'm putting this in my drop along with these as well. I kind of want this to be the color palette, like sage greens and warm toned colors and stuff like that. And as you guys know, I'm gonna do that design in a bit. I got a black t-shirt and I got a gray. And these are all the kid sizes because I think they make best for like the baby tee look. And I just got myself a plain white t-shirt because I just thought it would be cute for summer to just have like a plain white t-shirt. That's my little Joanne's haul. So, this is what the shirts look like on. Um, I kind of want to have like a baby tee vibe, but I got them in a size small because I just figured if I wanted to give this to someone or if someone wanted to buy it off of me, it'd be a better fit just because I'm really short and I wear a child's size extra small. Gray one, and then I also made a black one and I'll show you the black one. There's the black one and I think I like the gray one a little more but obviously black and white is like a really easy default choice. I just have this skirt from I don't, I don't know what the brand is but it's cute. I think this would look good with baggy jeans though. I'm just too lazy to change it. Like I think this could be kind of a cute look. I don't know just throwing stuff on but like a leather jacket with a skirt and just like a simple tea underneath. I don't know. So I ended up napping. I'm really lazy. Like I feel like I'm having like a weird mental health day because I just don't feel good. I think it's because I've just been eating a lot of bread. 
but I don't want to get groceries or anything because I go back to my apartment tomorrow. That's that. I guess I just have to kind of suffer for like one more day. <laughs> a little and then I might shower. I'm only going to work out because I feel kind of gross and like my body feels gross and I was laying down for like two and a half hours in the middle of the day, which I never really do. I do and I might draw a little or play video games. It really depends. I kind of want to like talk to my friends or talk to my best friend and play video games. Like I'm not in the mood to do other stuff because I feel kind of weird. <laughs> well, so we'll see what happens, but I'm probably gonna try to stretch. I'm not gonna film it because I kind of want to just do that and be alone mentally, mentally alone. I'll probably stretch and maybe work out a little and then shower and then see, see how I feel after. I wanted to show you guys what I drew. I didn't draw on camera because I was feeling weird and I didn't want to, I don't know, I just didn't want to film. But here is some little drawings I did. These are all referenced from Pinterest and I thought they were really cute. This, I don't know, just randomly drew it. And then I started this cute little flower drawing, which I like. Um, I'll probably keep working on that. But yeah, guys, that's pretty much the video, and we're kind of back where we started in the beginning, like with this clip of the same lighting from last night. Um, I just worked out, and I don't, I don't know what I'm gonna do for the rest of the night. This vlog is getting a little long. I noticed I have a lot of footage. I'm gonna do the for the rest of the night, but I'm probably going to just like draw or have like an ambient night alone type of vibe. I don't know, I might play video games or read, who knows. Um, but that's pretty much my day. I would take you guys later into the night, but it's just, I got so much done during the day that I just feel like I don't wanna film more and have the longest vlog ever. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed coming with me today. Um, sorry if it was boring. I know I was kind of in a down mood near the end. Um, pretty much it and I hope to see you guys in the next video. Thanks for tuning in for this really short kind of intimate video I don't know if you guys like these like day in the life ones um, The thing about these videos is that it's like filming all in one day and I can't like nitpick out the interesting moments for you So it's really just like this is my day <laughs> But yeah, um, I'll see you guys in the next video and I hope you guys are all doing well uh, Peace and love and all that and yeah Bye